I can get you guys a closer view of the uh, solar panels. Uh, the top one is a 9 watt Coleman solar panel and the bottom one is a 7.5 watt nature power solar panel that comes with a battery pack kit inside my blind. So just to kind of let you know what they look like. I wish I could get you a better view but they're about 12-13 feet up in the air. So, Alright here we are hunting blind. As you can see I got the little uh, solar power wires that come right off of there. I've got them stapled onto my thing and then they go inside the window there. Another uh, addition I have is my my little uh, gas uh, tank here that's powering my heater buddy and I added a little deck here so I've got some way to stand on things when I uh, come up here and actually have a backpack or something like that. So uh, here we are inside the hunting line and uh, what I'm going to do first is show you the lights. i got one right there and one right there and it's actually dark enough here that I should be able to give you an idea of what they look like and there they are so there's my uh, light A and light B and it really lightens things up in here when I have those lights on um, not going to use them very often except for when I'm you know getting in here um, but there's here's my batteries this is uh, basically a a kit it's a nature power battery kit basically comes with a, a 7.5 watt solar panel and it charges a battery inside here inside the battery which also must have its own inverter because um, it turns the power actually maybe it's not inverted maybe it just charges a battery and then I guess that's pretty much all it is um, this is where the solar power comes in this little wire so and it is charging right now and that red lights on indicating that it's charging down here I have a little USB plug so I can charge my cell phone out here through this and that's pretty much what I intended to do and then these are my two light wires each one of these layers wires goes to the lights that are up here so um, and they power a 12 LED light so this was a first thing I got this kind of through a, a work uh, point program at the where I work there's a they call them basically they're Q, Q perk points that you can spend things on on a website and I found that on the website and so I, I got it so then this was an inverter this is just a regular old you know it's a 200 watt inverter with a couple of plugs on it and it's also got a USB charging port um, and it's being powered of course by the 12 volt battery this is actually the 12 volt battery to my boat it's a marine cranking battery not really intended to be used for full discharge but I don't really feel like spending a hundred bucks on a battery that I'm just going to use during the hunting season when I'm done with this battery during the hunting season I'll put it back inside the house to maintain a normal temperature but for now it's actually just out here in the cold um, but it's being charged by the solar panel so I'm sure it's not doing you know any major damage to the battery um, ideally it would be stored at a room temperature but these batteries can handle it it's not going to kill the battery um, so basically that can power my laptop or um, I guess if I really wanted to if I got maybe a, a nicer deep cell battery I might be able to power a, a television maybe a VCR or something like that but it's mostly I just wanted to have it so I could power basically my cell phone and um, potentially um, I'm going to look into actually adding a Wi-Fi camera if I can get a battery that's a deep cell battery that will last a long time eventually. I want to put a Wi-Fi camera right here basically where this camera is. Um, and although there's a little bit of uh, raindrops in the screen here, maybe I would move it up a little bit or uh, something. Uh, but I want to get a Wi-Fi camera that will actually transmit a wireless signal through uh, a point-to-point -point IP network from here up to my house which is about a half a mile away so I'm actually posting this video in a question res uh, response type uh, question to anyone that has uh, experience with small long-range point-to-point uh, -point networks I'd really like to know uh, my biggest obstacle is these trees here as you can see there's about a 20 or 30 yard high uh, forest that goes between here and the half mile that I just walked to get here. So what I'm going to plan on doing is probably put up a mast uh, with a point-to-point -point antenna um, and that's ultimately where this whole solar powered thing is going to go. It's, uh, I want to have uh, kind of a, a real-time 360 degree moving camera that I can put inside here and control wirelessly from an IP uh, location, basically a webcam. 
Um, so, anyways, let me know if you have any pointers on that, and let me know what you think of my new uh, hunting blind. This is uh, my heater body. It will definitely keep it nice and uh, warm in here. Um, so I'm looking forward to a nice season. Um, also going to follow this video up real quick. You should see some pictures of some of the deer that we've taken uh, pictures of on the trail cam, which actually the trail cam uh, position is right on that tree right there. You can't really see it, but it's right there in the tree in the very middle of the screen. Um, and basically the trail camera has got a few pictures of some nice bucks on it. 